I, I think I think as a young enthusiastic coach you, you kind of have that aspiration mm -hmm. of making it big and then now I'm kind of more at a, at a downsizing phase it got almost a little too big for yeah. for one guy to handle and you kind of see that a little bit today there's a lot of people here it, it, it's an evolution it completely just snowballs <laughs> sometimes out of control yeah. uh, no I, I mean I think anybody would admit that Rick Schur and, and now his wife Jen Schur have been the biggest influence in this area they've been unbelievable um, and what he did has been incredible and so absolutely when I started out I was very inspired by him uh, and and he's he's the best coach in the world though and I'm just some dad with a pole vault pit in his backyard so we've we've modified it and I kind of refer to this now as like a pole vault youth group and uh, so it's all about having a, a very positive environment and providing a positive experience for kids you know, I told the construction company that I wanted a four foot wide, 120 foot long sidewalk put in the backyard. And uh, so they said, okay. And they came in and they, I thought this yard was completely level. And they said, oh, but over 120 feet, it drops two and a half feet. So they had to build this berm up here. Um, and so everybody thought I was nuts. But, uh, you know, the big construction trucks driving back here was insane. But uh, yeah, you know, it just started. And then, uh, kind of a little bit of an obsession it just kept getting a little bigger and better and, and every season it was almost a challenge well what can I add so the kids are excited when they come back and they see something and there's a wow factor mm -hmm. and uh, now I'm to the point where I, I gotta stop I can't do anymore <laughs> well first impression was this is different and it, it is but it doesn't really matter because everyone here is just so helpful and it just helps you improve so much that it's just the environment doesn't really change anything it's pretty amazing. I mean, we get to work with some of the best vaulters around. Everybody's coming from everywhere, and we just, Mike's great. He always is helping us and doing whatever he can to help us be better. And all the other coaches that are here are just really good and help us a lot. Yeah, it's uh, really crazy when you think about it. Uh, yeah, I don't really think of it as backyard much. It's yeah. like halfway through each practice, I'm like, wait a second, this, this, this guy's backyard. <laughs> uh, yeah, it's, it's great, though. It's, uh, it's a great facility. Uh, it's a little bit intimidating because obviously there is the there are the uh, experienced pole vaulters so they're all better than me and uh, uh, but it's a great learning learning uh, learning place you know they everybody helps everybody here they uh, they all help me out right off the bat and I I feel like I've come a pretty long way for a year um, I, I'm I'm expecting a pretty good four year run uh, I'm, I like all their coaching staff I like I've met some of the uh, the athletes that are already there, there are already some elite athletes there, and uh, it seems like a pretty good uh, place to be if you're a track athlete. Like, uh, great coaches, Coach Henshin, he's the one that came around and recruited me. He's been to all my meets, pretty much all of my postseason meets, the ones that he could make it to. So obviously that shows a little bit of dedication from the coach. And uh, yeah, that's one of the big things that an athlete I look, look for.